Okay, so now we will revise how do we write the numbers. We can write the numbers in the expanded form. Expanded form is when you add the hundreds and tens and ones separately. So, hundreds separately, tens separately, and ones separately. We write the expanded form as an addition sentence. Like here, how many hundreds can you count? We can count three blocks of hundreds. So, it is 300. How do we write 300? Like this. This is 300. Now, we will go to tens. How many tens do you have? One, two, three, four. Four tens, we write like this. Four tens equals 40. And now, the last one, we go to ones. How many ones do you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven ones. We write it just as number seven. So, expanded form is an addition sentence where you add hundreds and tens and ones separately. This is called expanded form. Expanded form. To understand and know how to write hundreds, please revise. These are hundreds. Hundreds have two zeros. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900. Also, revise the tens because we read them differently. We say 110, we say 10. Two tens, we call it 20. Three tens, sorry, Three tens, thirty. Four tens, forty. Five tens, fifty. Six tens, sixty. Seven tens, seventy. Eight tens, eighty. And nine tens, we say ninety. So be careful with the tens. And these are ones. Ones are simple. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. These are hundreds, tens, and ones. Let's practice. How do we write this number in expanded form? Expanded form is the form written in the addition sentence where we add hundreds, tens, and ones separately. Okay? You remember that? Here we will start always from hundreds. How many hundreds do you see? I see 400. How many tens can you count? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 tens, 8 T. And how many ones do you have? 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 ones. What do we call this form? This form of a number we call expanded form. Expanded form. Now, if you want to write a standard form, what will you do? You will take the first digits of each number. From 400, you will take number 4. Then, from 80, you will take number 8. And from 1, you will take number 4. And you will get a standard form. What do we call this form? Standard form. And you can read it. 484. 484. One more time, the practice. We're going to do expanded form when we will add hundreds, tens, and ones separately. As you see, we have 100 block. How many tens do we have? Three. Three tens equals thirty. How many ones do we have? Six. Six. What will be the standard number? Put the numbers together. First, copy one. Then, copy three. Then, copy six. 
one hundred thirty six. That's a standard number. One last time. How many hundreds do you have? One hundred. How many tens? One ten. That will be ten. How many ones? Five. What will be the standard form? Copy from one hundred the first digit one. From ten you will copy one. And from five you will copy five. The standard form of the number is 115. So, you can write the numbers also in this form, standard form. As I said, this is expanded form. You can see you will take the first digits, not the zeros. Start from hundreds, then tens and ones. First number is from hundreds number, the three. 6 is from 60 and 9 is from 1s. We will not take the zeros. We will take the first numbers starting from 100s, 10s and 1s and you will get the standard number. Here are more standard numbers. Okay, we can also write the numbers in the word form like this. 361 522, 253, 689. This is the word form. Now, you can practice during the summer vacation. How do we write the numbers? It will be very, very useful at the beginning of the grade 2. So, one more time, we write the numbers in three different forms in expanded form, standard form, and word form. This is expanded form when you add hundreds, tens, and ones in addition sentence separately. Let's do it. How many hundreds do we have? 200. How many tens? 3 tens, 3, 30. And ones? 5. Now how do I make the standard form? Take the first digit from 200, I will take 2, from 30, I will take 3 and 5. 2, 3, 5, 235. And how will I write it? 235. Well done. Now you can practice. Do not forget to make the expanded form. You need to add hundreds, tens, and ones separately. To make the standard form, you will take first digits from hundreds, tens, and ones. Put them together and you get the standard form. Count the blocks and write expanded form. When you finish expanded form, write the standard form. I will, I will do this one with you together. If you want to work alone, please work alone. You have the worksheet and you can do everything by yourself, okay? But I will do it with uh, quickly for those who don't want to do it alone. Let's count hundreds. How many hundreds do we have? 300. How many tens? 3 tens. 3 tens is 30. How many ones? 5. So if we will take the first digit, we will have 3, 3, 5. And that will be the standard form, 335. Let's go to the next one. How many hundreds can you count? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 hundreds, 500. How many tens can you count? One, two, three, four, five again. But five tens is fifty. How many ones do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Five hundred, then fifty and eight. Let's put them in the standard form. Take five, five, and eight. The number will be five hundred fifty-eight. Let's go and read this one. Count how many hundreds do you have? 100. How many tens? Oops, there are too many, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 tens will be 90. And how many ones do you have? 4. So let's take the first digits and write them in the standard form. From 100, we will take 1. From 99 and here 4. 194, it will be 194.
And the last page, do the same thing. Expanded form, standard form, expanded form, standard form. If you want to, you can pause the video and you can do it alone. And then start the video again and see the answers. If you don't, you can work with me. Again, start doing expanded form with hundreds, then tens and ones. How many hundreds do we have? Six. How many tens? One, two, three, four, five. Five. How many ones? Three. Now, what will be the standard form? 653. Next one. How many hundreds do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven hundred. How many tens? I don't see any, do you? That means zero. And how many ones? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine ones. Now this is a little bit tricky because here we need to write seven, zero, nine. Before we will write it here, seven, zero, nine. Seven, zero, nine because we have no tens. That means zero tens. Let's do next one. How many hundreds do you have? One, two, three, four, five, five hundred. How many tens? Six, sixty. And how many ones? Two. Now take the first digits and make the standard form. It will be 562. Next one. How many hundreds do you have? Two. How many tens do you have? Two. How many zeros do you have? Zero. Now let's do the final standard form. Here we will take two. Here we will take number two and zero. Two, two, zero. Two hundred twenty. And the last one. How many hundreds? Three. How many tens? Four. And how many ones? Six. What will be the standard form? 346. That's it. Thank you. I hope you understand this lesson. Um, keep it up. Work hard. Um, and enjoy the day. Bye.